grabs. And it's going to be Chantal Labra who will get this one underway. Germany playing from left to right for the first seven points. And the cut shot is a good one from Lati. It's a bit of the net, but falls on the right side from a Finland perspective. First uh, appearance on the Red Bull Arena for the Finnish pair. And uh, I think they'll handle it just fine. It's not, not manically busy as it has been. The crowd building up throughout the day. So it shouldn't put them under too much pressure, just the pressure of the situation. Great get from uh, Lieutenant. Put away as well. First World Championships for the Finnish pair. And, uh, they're acquitting themselves uh, very well. They just missed out on qualification for the Olympics last year, failing at the uh, final hurdle in the European uh, qualification stages. And that's a lovely looking shot from Suda. qualified on their international ranking, as did the uh, German pair. <laughs> now here's a chance for Germany to win point on serve. Good block. Now Finland have the advantage. The roll down the line is put away by Lieutenant. Good block from Lati. Out the reach of Barbara. Plenty of Finnish support in the crowd. Barbara, the receiver of serve, goes cross court, and uh, Lettinen is there, and she tries to roll it. But good dig from Barbara, and now advantage with Germany. And that now swings back to. Well, I was going to say the set was far too close to the net from Lettinen. Gave Lati no chance at all, and Germany survived. Finland will be kicking themselves. They didn't bring that point home. They had the advantage on a couple of occasions. from Lava and again Lieutenant is there and this time she wins the power battle at the net and at the first side switch at Finland in front 4-3 Labra once more, Suda with the set, roll shot onto the line from Labra, levels it up. Spikes. Suda will just uh, take her time, compose herself. It's a day for sunscreen, water, and hats. Slip, slap, slop. You uh, are Australian. Nice poke from Lara to the back. Of the court. Nice work. So five all. Suda with the ball. Oh, 
just long. Marty thinks about it, but that is the first point on serve in the match, and it goes Germany's way. Good set. Let's have another look. Just evades the block. Now, Lati, who's been serving pretty well in this uh, tournament. She's got 16 service aces uh, to this point. Only five service errors. Barbara, very good on the cut shot. Thumb forward, opening the hand. Merton and getting there but unable to control. Poke, it's long again from Lati. That's two now that have just missed. And at the second side switch. Yeah, you can see just missing. That Germany lead 8-6. again so they're getting some joy here the German pair going to uh, Lati the younger of the two Finland players again they go to Lati and the tactical serve dropping short Lati with the roll shot Labra easily picks it up and a chance for another point on serve Labra cuts it and from six all it's gone to 10-6 Germany. A run of four points and a timeout has been called by Finland to try and stop the rot. And Suda gives her partner a big round of applause. That's as good as a point. And they'll be delighted as they sit down. Now this is the fourth meeting between the pair going back to their first at the European uh, Masters in Baku back in 2014. Uh, the German pair have won three of the one, uh, three of the four, sorry, Finland have won one. There you can see the run of points for Germany. Uh, the win for Finland coming in pool play at the Fuji Open in 2015. Uh, they've met once this year, the Porich uh, major five star. That was in uh, June, end of June. Lover and Suda, who were ranked two there, as they uh, are here, uh, or seeded two. I uh, won that one in three sets, 22-20, 20-22, 15-10. That's the only three-set match between the uh, pair. That's the only match in uh, knockout play. Every other match has been in pool play. Merton picks up the Suda shot and then makes a real mess of the attempted cut shot. And they're just at sixes and sevens here, the uh, finished pair. Now, Lati, he's been a little bit troubled. Suda keeps it alive, gets cute, and Lati will go with the second uh, time shot, and they've got their scoreboard ticking once again. Nice work. The serve is wide. Seven twelve now to the German pair. Two more points until the technical timeout. Oh dearie me. Well, the Germans hardly need any more fortune, but they get it there. 
big net cord and just dies on the finished side of the net. A hand of apology goes up. Lati finishes off the first part of the set with a kill, but it is Germany that are in front by 5, 13, 18 as we head to the technical timeout. Here's a replay of that final uh, point. And, uh, well, the Finnish flag still flying, but there's a lot of work for the Finnish pair to do here. Well, the German pair. Uh, Labra appearing in her second World Championship. She went to The Hague with Suda. They finished 17th there. But uh, this is a fourth World Championship for uh, Suda. Her best finish was with Jana Kohler uh, in Rome in 2011. Yeah, incidentally, they beat a Finnish pair, the Nystrom sisters, in the uh, first knockout stage. Then beat uh, Kaiser and Van Ersel. Uh, in the round of 16 to set up the uh, to set up the uh, a, a place in the quarter final, but then lost to uh, uh, the Czech pair of Tapolova uh, and Djokova in straight sets in the quarter finals. Good work by the Finnish pair. Suda's first touch is not a good one. And this is just a restart that the Finnish pair would have wanted. On the first two points after the technical timeout. And then the service error. Lati. Labra serves to Lati. Sets a little close to the net. And, uh, comes back off the set. Oh, off the block, excuse me. Lands out, so points for Finland. Lieutenant. So Suda. Nedlin goes left, and Suda goes the other way. Nice work. Margaret as well. Now, can she finish off? Auntie is there. Her turn to try and finish off, pokes it on the diagonal and she needed every inch or centimetre of sand for that poke shot. She's missed the last two, but this one, plenty of height. This goes down the line, it's out, but it's cross court. And as you can see, laying just inside the line, that's the longest part of the court from the antenna to the corner on the diagonal. And she used it wisely. Yeah, nice work from Labra going over on the second touch, just changing it up. Shoulders pointing one way and coming across the shoulders. Nothing that the Finnish defense can do about that. Good pick from Labra. Now her turn to cut. And she cuts really well. German pair looking on good form. Maintain their good form from this year. And 
only once have they finished outside the top 10 this year. The German pair, that was 17th in The Hague. Losing in the first knockout round. And they were seeded two. Yeah, good work from Lati. But they need points on serve here, Finland. And otherwise, they're going to be defending set points very quickly. Ethnant to Lava Suda. Off the block, Kulati sets. And Lettinen finishes, so... There is a point on serve, but more required. At least another couple, you feel. And then with the jump float serve to Suda. Set from Labra and Suda's spike gets a little bit of net cord. Just moves it away from Lieutenant. Lieutenant with the set now. Lati, can she finish? Yes, she can. Now, Lati will go to the service line and she will require a couple of points. So, here we go. Suda again, the recipient. That's a good set. So, Suda threading it between block and antenna onto the line. from Lati. That was a difficult one to control. Cross court. Labra is there to keep it alive. Now can she finish and bring up set points? No, she can't because Lettinen is there to set up Lati. Labra cross court into the net. And that side switch. Germany leading 19-16. Points required here, otherwise it's going to be four set points. Exactly what we have. Four set points. The first on the Suda serve. The uh, remaining three, if required, will be on the, the Lati serve. So Suda to Lati. Lati rolls. Lati finds the sand. Saves the first of the set points. But here is set point number two. Suda then for the first set. Yeah! Nails it, cross courts. Lettinen can't handle the pace. And Germany, who have not dropped a set in this tournament yet, take the first set, 21-17. It's the third set that Finland have lost. Confirmation then that Germany, the number two seeds, 21-17. They win the first set. And what do the stats tell us? Well, as you can see, uh, the Finns have had more attacks, but uh, it's uh, fairly level, but just uh, errors coming at the wrong stage. So here is the uh, Germany third placement, as you can see, really going after Lati, and uh, just the two missed. 
And, uh, that's the height at which she's received the serve. That's the height of those bubbles. And, uh, an interesting stat. There you go. You see some people, somebody shouting for Germany. And, uh, there you go. Here we go. Set two. Underway. Littonen will get us underway. Yeah, good blocking. Great start to the second set for Finland. Service ace makes it 3 1. Some daylight for the first time for Finland. Nati getting half a block on it. Good block from Suda. Excellent work from the German blocker. Second block of the match for her. Marvel picks up the cross court from Lati and goes down the line. And from 1 3 to 4 3. Germany lead at the first side switch. Recipient. And it's a run of points for Germany at the start of the second set, just as they had a run of points at the start of the first. In the first set, it went from 6 all to 11 6. Here it's gone from 1 3 to currently 5 3. Suda doing a good job with the ball. block from Suda but it's still alive for Finn Lettinen. Another good block but it lands out. Really unlucky for Suda. She's having an excellent game, Suda. Up 
both German players. They've been sharing the attacks, nine attacks each. Heavily favoured in uh, Lati's favour for Finland. So, uh, 12th attack, better than just five. And you've obviously seen something in videos because coming into this match, Lebanon had done most of the attacking. But they're just asking some different questions of the Finns. And at the moment, the Finns don't seem to have the answer. down the line and Germany going through the gears here Lati looks uh, like she's tiring she was slow to get up after her last spike Five. At the second side switch, it is uh, Germany very much in control. Point better off, and in fact, timeout is called by Finland. It was uh, eight six. The first. Uh, Side, second side switch, sorry, in the first set. And so Lerton and Lati called an early timeout in set one, even earlier this time round. Uh, talked about the German pairs, gold medals in Porec at last year in Gestad. This uh, second three times, third twice. The Finns, well, they've got two results on the world tour. They were second at the Antalya Open in 2016. They lost to Ludwig and Valkenhorst. That was the first of six titles for the German uh, pair of Ludwig and Valkenhorst last year. And they were fourth at the Sochi Open back in 2015. Heavens above, it's a little bit warm for a hat, isn't it? Obviously not. I'm hoping that's made of cotton. Plenty of support for the Finns. But they've got themselves a really difficult task on their hands. That's a point they would expect. Now, points required on the Lieutenant serve. To Suda Lambra with the set. Suda finds the kill. Just don't look like making any inroads into this deficit, Finland. Again, Lati having to receive serve. Fairly slowly. Now, can she find this good serving that's, that's brought her so many aces in the first four matches? Not at the moment, anyway. Lidnam picks that cross court up and goes cross court herself, and that is one back. We'll deal with another now.
Nati again goes to Suda, who's first touch takes Labra out of play. Now, here's an opportunity for another point if the set is good. Lettinen finds the mark. A perfect timed run of points for Finland. Back to within one. Now, can they find another? A little run of three. Can they go to Suda, whose first touch is much better this time? And that is out. So they do get another point. Ten all. Excellent work. This is the last point for the technical timeout. Coming at a good time, you feel, for Germany, having lost at the last four. Metinen does well. Here's a chance to go into the technical timeout in front. Well, a run of five points just when they needed it. And Finland lead 11-10 at the technical timeout in the second set. 6-10 down. A brilliant turnaround from the team in blue. Well, some, some pressure for the Germans here. Let's have a look at their spike placement. And, uh, there you go. The, uh, the height of the needles is where the uh, Finnish players have touched it or not in case, in case of the winner. Uh, there on the left-hand side. And, uh, oh, trying to hit the flanks. Germany on their spike placement. That's in the second set. So, a great run of points here on the Lati serve. Five of them. Can they make it six? Again, they go to Suda. Good block. Lava is there, though, to pick up the pieces. Cross court. And they finally get their scoreboard ticking. Germany, 11 all. Now, Finland have got to side out here. Just to stabilise things, as it were. They don't want to let Germany pull away again. Very close to the net. Net touch. Yep, net fault from Lati. And just as we said, they don't want to let Germany go on a run of points. They concede two. Let's have another look. There you go, the knee getting the bottom of the net. Good blocking, good reactions from Letton. And now can she finish off? No, she can't. Suda is there, off the net, and they win the point to level it up at 12 all. So not too much damage done on the, that German run. Just the two points. Good reactions, Letton there getting the right hand out. Lieutenant. Service error. Nazi having to take that fairly high up on the right hand side. Suda gets back on the blocking. Another run of two points for Germany. Oh, nice work. Oh, it's just out. Challenge coming. There's a challenge. 
Straight away from Lati. Challenge for in out. So, look. We'll get Hawkeye in a minute. This is just an initial look from our camera, our TV cameras. Yeah. That might be the right call out. So Hawkeye will tell us definitively. Bake waits as does everybody else. Here we go. Ball in, it just gets the outside of the line. Good challenge. So, a good challenge makes it 13-14. And it's going to be Lati to serve again. Two challenges remain for Finland. Remember, it's two challenges per set. If you get it right, you retain your challenge. So, so long as you're right, you can challenge as many times as you like. Service error. Side switch, 15-13, Germany. This is the... Uh, Business end of set two. Suda. Lati. This has been the case throughout. Four touches, so point for a uh, double touch, in fact. Fourteen fifteen now. Lertinen with the serve. Labra Suda finds the line or inside of 16-14. I'm surprised we see serve off the Suda block. 15-16. Sorry to Suda. Suda. Well read by Lieutenant. Now Lieutenant off the block. It's Marty improvising. Labra off the block. And she's not going to get there. It's level at 16 all. All timeout called. And Finn's doing a really good job in this second set. Remember, they were in real trouble at one stage, but went on a, a good run of points. They were 10 6 down, went to 11 10. That's that run on the top in the middle you can see. Nice on the back of the neck. Quickest way to cool the human body down. And, uh, these two pairs playing for the right to meet the Canadian pair Pavan and Humana Paredes who have just beaten Fetchart and Hubli of Switzerland in straight sets to book their place in the quarterfinal. The Canadian pair beat Barbara and Fernanda yesterday. The Brazilians, the Brazilian defending champions split for this season, but uh, both of them are out. Losing yesterday. 
Good work from Lati, but still with Germany. Labra. <laughs> finds the unguarded backcourt. 16 17. Labra shaping to go cross court, then opening the hand to go down the line. Lati. Letting him with the set, now he has to a little block for the arc of the back. Arcs the ball into unguarded territory. Marber had gone the other way as well. Cross court, letting him picks it. Now, can she give them the lead? She's missed it. She has missed it. That was an opportunity for Finland. There from Lavra. Levels it up 18 all. Okay, it's all about pressure. How do you deal with it? Lati has possession. Another run of points on the serve would do a world of good. Lavra, the receiver this time. Good block. Suda does well. Lavra sets. Suda. Off the Lati block. Oh, that was desperately close. So, Germany serving at 19 18. If Suda can win points, she will gain her team two match points. The first of which on her serve, the second on the Lettonen serve. But here she goes. So, to Lati, which has been the story throughout. Lati off the block, and it lands in. And so, it's two match points for Germany, the first on the Suda serve. Everyone is on their feet. Suda, Lati, letting them with the sets. And Lati goes cross court to save the first. So, here we go. Lettinen, can she find the point on serve to keep this match alive? Suda to win it. She does. And Germany are through to the quarterfinals. Finland are out. They will finish ninth. But Suda and her partner 